Okay, Dyson, so we're here at the Shrine of Remembrance. You've got your new jumper today. How important is it for you to be a part of this occasion each year? Yeah, look, it's a, a massive honour um, to play on Anzac Day. Um, obviously, we know what the day means to all Australians and um, I guess to be able to represent uh, those that have fallen um, for our country, I think, um, is an enormous privilege. Is it something you can get used to being a part of this game or do you still get a bit overawed at some, at some times? Uh, something you get used to. Um, look, I think you, you just embrace the occasion. Um, I've really enjoyed these games and um, love the whole build up, the week leading into it. And um, you know, one of the most special moments is that minute of silence. You've got 100 odd thousand people dead silent. Um, and I guess that just shows the respect that Australians have for, for Anzac Day. Is it possible to describe that feeling when you're there ahead of the game and, and do you just let yourself get swept up in it or do you try to stay focused as well? Nah, look, I, I really try and embrace it and just, just enjoy the moment. Um, I remember my first first Anzac game, I could hear a little baby crying up the top the top floor of the MCG and uh, I nearly had a little smile on my face and it's quite funny but yeah, it's uh, just an extraordinary occasion. How proud are you to lead a club like Essendon that is always at the forefront with things like this and other initiatives as well? Yeah, it's huge. Um, you know, look, it's a, I guess it's a quite a, a great responsibility that I really enjoy. And, um, you know, our club's enormous and, and right at the forefront in, you know, pushing towards um, community engagement and also um, being able to represent, um, I suppose, big occasions, which is awesome.